If you say it loud enough, you always sound cold. Oh, we gotta stop for a moment before we go to the clip. Say it. No, say it. Listen, you gotta hear this. Right. Califragilisticexpialidocious. No! Sex, no, I did not you put say sex it. in there. I keep saying I say sex me, <laughs> and I don't no, say true. that. You just did it It's again. a children's That's movie. Wow. Expialidocious. <laughs> there you okay, go. Okay, there you go. All right, uh, Dick is here, and he needs no introduction, so let's just run this. The Dick Van Dyke Show. Starring Dick Van Dyke. Old you, pretty chitty bang bang, chitty chitty bang bang, we love you. And in chitty chitty bang bang, chitty chitty bang bang, what we'll do? It can get a little spooky around here at night, so you might want to put a few lights on. And the most important thing of all to remember, don't let anything in or out. Out. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen. He's telling us to keep moving. Mr. Dick Van Dyke is here. Uh, now, it's great to see you again. Thank you for you're, coming. Thank you, Steve. Good <laughs> to see you. Uh, you're 89. You're going to be 90, I think, in December. I said in December, I'll be yeah, 90, okay, yeah. Okay, right. You're doing yeah. really well. Yeah, yeah you <laughs> are. And we want to know, me more than you, the rest. You want to know. He's uh, getting there quicker. Uh, what is it? What? Because you've been through a lot in life. Life has not been a breeze for you, right? Oh, or, no. Or anybody. No, I have all the uh, infirmities, yes. you know, appropriate for my age. <laughs> uh, actually, my, my publisher apparently noticed I was a little spryer than some of my contemporaries, especially <laughs> the dead ones. Yeah, yeah. And I said, well, it'll be a rather slim volume. Keep moving. You yeah. know, what else are you going to say? But as I sat down to write it, I realized there is a lot more to say, and there's some codgers out there who might benefit from it. But you know, old people today used to be venerated. Now they're ignored and sidelined Shoved and to the side. institutionalized mm -hmm. as yeah. fast as they can get rid of them. Can I, can I bring up an episode uh, that has stuck with a lot of people? It was the LA Times wrote something about your show at that time and said it was a show for old geezers. That's right. Mm -hmm. yeah. Really? And <laughs> Dick Van Dyke does not take things sitting down. <laughs> T tell him what you did. Well, I, I said, you know, it's a, it's a, a wonderful time of life. That if, if you're lucky enough to get there, yes. it, it's, uh, you know, it's not a, a place where you're committed. And I said, I'm 75, and I can whip your ass. I can oh, whip yeah! your ass. Now, now, he not only, uh, it's, it's a little distracting to see the show right now, but I want to get back to this. You not only said that, you wrote it in the L.A. Times. Mm -hmm. I did. I sent a, a letter to the in Times. In the L.A. Times, in a, in a day of more decorum, the yeah. letter from Dick Van Dyke said, I will <laughs> I whip your that. ass. Wow. Yeah. You're a The guy turned out to be 6'4 and about 250. Oh, uh, wow. I said, Details. I can't And then did you say when he came after you, don't hit an old man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah. But All what right. I love in the book is, well, it seems like, and we've had the pleasure of meeting you a couple times, you are a kid at heart. Age really yeah. doesn't matter. And you say, if I feel like dancing, I dance. If I feel like singing, yeah, I, I sing. Video. I don't care where I am or who's watching. <laughs> exactly. I think that's the best advice. Oh, yeah, it is. Keep moving, of course. But attitude is so oh, much everything. so important for a person that age. And today, a, a, a only person has to be self-sufficient. The I think it was the who who wrote a song, I, I hope I die before I get old. Mm -hmm. People are more afraid of aging <laughs> mm -hmm. than yeah, they are of death these days. Right. And I'm having one of the time of my life. I'm yes. still singing and dancing. And I, the book is getting some good reviews from the medical profession really? because it's about not only movement, but attitude. Yeah. Right. Uh, the attitude is everything. It's not what happens to you. It's the attitude you take. Right. That's, that's all that really does. And I reiterate, mean about three times in the book, never start going down the stairs sideways <laughs> to, because of your knees, yeah. because that starts the, the hips out of joint, then the back goes, and next thing you do is fall down, break your hip. Mm. So even if it hurts a little, go well, down the stairs. So you're gonna be 90 in December, right? Yeah. How old do you feel though? I don't, I don't feel age at all. I don't feel any different. Yeah? Yeah, I, I have some arthritis, but it doesn't bother me because right. mm -hmm. every morning I go to the gym and okay. then I swim. I know. Yeah, 
I we, used to see you at the gym out in Malibu, and you would be, I'd be, there's Dick Van Dyke doing push ups. There he is doing sit ups. Whatever he's doing, I want to be doing. <laughs> and like, you still do all of that stuff. Oh, right? I was there this morning, six uh, o'clock. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Every morning. Yeah, and, and a lot of people said, oh, I can't do what he's doing because I'm not old enough. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Dick, um, you do have a genetic blessing in your life. But not everybody has. There's no has. doubt. Yes. There's no doubt about that. Uh, yeah. But it, it, it's important to stress, you haven't had just this wonderful, glamorous life. You've had all the downs, even in, in spades sometimes compared to other people. Oh, yeah. You've had the, the, the key person in your life die a couple of times. Yes. Uh, you've gone through all of that, and you have been down. <laughs> Right? Yeah, exactly. How yeah. did you get back up? I don't know. It's, it's, it's that thing. You know, pick yourself up. Every time you get knocked down, get back up. And get up more often than you get knocked yeah. down. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It, it's a, there's a certain spirit to it, I think. Uh, I'm one of those people who wakes up on the right side of the bed in the morning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I had four kids, two who were grumpy in the morning. and two. But I'm uh, optimistic. I can't. Mm -hmm. It's the kind of thing you can't help. I, think I just, uh, it's, it, this is a great time of life, and if a person 90 years old is sedentary, starts going to the gym, even if you want to do 10 minutes, mm -hmm. getting there, yeah. I have to have a cup of coffee and go before I talk myself out of it <laughs> every morning. <laughs> totally sure. But you. if you can do 10 minutes, 12 minutes, yeah. that's all. It's you for you. You'd be amazed how it's fast. It's for your body, but it's for your it's mind. Really it's for your mind. mind. Get some oxygen and some blood us, going through I mean, there. Yeah. For anyone of any age, yeah. it's just about getting there and getting into the routine. It's hard for everybody. Oh, well, of course it is. Yeah. I, I want to move on to something else in the book. And by the way, I really do recommend the book. It's a very easy read that really sticks with you mm -hmm. because of the things you say. Uh, you are married to a wonderful woman. Oh, boy. She is a 300 years younger than you. That's <laughs> 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 right. And she's right there. there. She, yeah, she, yeah. She is yeah, be careful. Hi. 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 I think you? she's yeah. also responsible for yeah. keeping you young. That oh, helps. yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah. We, we sing and dance all day. I went in the kitchen the other day. She was doing the dishes with her tap. She was tap what? dancing while she was doing the dishes. Oh, you met your match, right? <laughs> Yeah, That's she's so a good singer cute. and a, and a good, great good, dancer. Good morning to you, and thank you for coming in as well. Yeah. Uh, there's a thing in your book about how your brother Jerry Van Dyke says to you, she's 46 years younger than you. You were 46 when she was born. What do you talk about? <laughs> what do you talk about, right? Isn't that funny? That's all he could ask you. Uh -huh. he, I said, what's good about Asia? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> What he, my brother's a bit of a curmudgeon. So he yes. didn't get the positive gene that wasn't <laughs> yeah. like inherited. But also, you then, therefore, being Dick Van Dyke, you make a list of the things you talk about. So yes. what do you say? Yeah. What do you yeah. say? And we go through history. There's a little philosophy, a little religion in there. Even right. I have some ideas about that. Uh, some people have said I, I started in thinking of. I have a lot of friends who haven't changed their mind about anything in their lives. Uh -huh. Despite new information that comes in, yes. yeah. they still think the same, feel the same. Just close mind. An open mind is mm -hmm. one of the best things when you get older. Mm -hmm. Keep an open mind. Be ready to change. How else do you keep the connections keep and the blood mm -hmm. circulating in your brain? Yeah. yeah. I work the New York Times crossword with a pen. Oh, and you're I, good. Wait, 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 I don't wait, always finish it. Wait, wait a second. <laughs> what day of the week? Not Saturday. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. No, I, I think four That's times in my life yeah. I finished the Saturday one. Wow. But, so yeah. last time you were here, we got such a treat. You did a little number for us. Oh, would I have the quartet? Yes. Yes, yes. you yeah. do have it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We're still singing. Here. Oh, chitty, you chitty, pretty, chitty, bang, bang, chitty, chitty, bang, bang, we love you. And chitty, and chitty, pretty, chitty, bang, bang, chitty, chitty, bang, bang, what we'll do. Near chitty, far chitty, in our little car, whatever time we'll spend. Bang, bang, chitty, chitty, bang, bang, I find for fender, fender. Bang, bang, chitty, chitty, bang, bang, I find for fender. Chitty, chitty, bang, bang, chitty, chitty, bang, bang, find for fender. Oh, that's pretty good. Now, you just said what I said earlier. I'm looking at this thing when you were here that, that time, and I remember you were always the tallest, thinnest guy around, and now you're a little guy with Exactly. <laughs> what happened? It happens. You, the vertebrae do that. Yeah. I thought they were making my pants too long. It was me. <laughs> this is terrible. I, I was at the doctor. I got on the scales. He said, 170. 5'11 and a half. I said, wait a minute, I'm 6'1. Yes. He said, oh, we'll try these. Yeah. I, I shrunk down 
Now I'm 5'11". No way. But, Two inches? Yeah. Two it happens as you yeah. get older. I had said, well, have I had have said, you shrunk any? My goal in life is to live to be 5'1". <laughs> <laughs> that means I'd live a long time, right? Yeah, so, right. Uh, and in terms of... Uh, <laughs> I loved it. In terms of, uh, <laughs> of, of, of the psychology of living, and, and you're kind of gifted with that, the physical part of living, there are a lot of people who came from a time when if you were 60 years old or 55, it was over. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's right? true. That yeah. is absolutely true. The I know people are 60 who are very old. Yeah. <laughs> you can't hang out with them. No, I don't. They're too no. slow. Yeah. I've, my quartet, my wife is, yeah. is 40, what, three, or coming, going to be. No, she just was. How old? Yeah. Hi, I want you to meet Dick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, I mean, she's the greatest thing. You know, I mean, I have uh, friends who, you know, who are widowers. Yes. And uh, I said, you know, I said, I'll, Probably spend the rest of my life by myself, and look what happened. And look what yeah. happened. Fell in love yeah. and changed your life. So I'm, I have yeah, like yeah. a third life. Your life. It's wonderful. All right, Dick's new book is called Keep Moving. Thank it's you. out now. He is going to be at Barnes and Noble next Thursday night at the Grove. It starts at seven o'clock. Dick Van Dyke. Here's and the best. Tom Bergeron's going to going to be the interlocutor. He's, he's going to interview you. Great stuff. It should be crazy. Great stuff.